Well, holy crap, the cold washer heated up. Well, that escalated quickly. So, here we have it. I built this last... Last year sometime? I don't know. Yeah, it would have been last year. Winter? I'm probably winter. I love, I love these kind of winter dioramas with the mud and the snow and all the crap. So, use your imagination. This could be Korea. This could be Eastern Germany. I don't know. I was read one really cool series of books called... Um, Oh, something Blitzkrieg. And, you know, Germany lasted right up until 48, 49, and then the Russians rolled through, then the Americans started fighting the Russians, and the Amer Germans joined in with the Americans, and yeah, it was quite the, quite the shit show. So what we got is a whole hodgepodge of kits. Uh, let's start with the two American ones. They're both from Dragon. This is the M47 Patton, I believe, because it's got the smaller uh, roller wheel right there and a slightly different uh, rear engine deck. And this is the M26 Pershing that first got going in uh, Second World War. So I had all three of these kits just sitting on the shelf collecting dust. So I figured, what the hell, let's do something kind of funky. So what we've got here, this is a Tamiya set of American GIs, World War II. They fit in perfectly for the uh, the time period, late 40s, early 50s. Built box stock right out of the right out of the packaging, and uh, of course they're to me. They're really nice. They're they're a really nice little set. Let me just set this up here a bit, boys. Okay, so we've got the uh, got the Tamiya fig figures. I think they're 30 bucks for what six figures. We got the two guys hanging out over here. I wanted to kind of do them all in a hodgepodge of different color, uniform colors. So these guys are in the greens, these are in the tans and the browns. Um, we've got the guy here ready to pop a grenade onto the, uh, onto the, onto the commies. So I just thought, well, okay, what, what happened here? All right, we got a, we got a convoy of uh, American tanks got shot up. Uh, these guys were along for the ride, hit the, hit the decks. You know, we, we lost the tank crews. They didn't brew up. They just went in and did a whole bunch of nasty-ass ricochets. And uh, yeah, then this um, IS-3 comes rolling up. Now the Kami figures are a mix of Tamiya. So we've got Tamiya, Tamiya, um, Tamiya, Tamiya. We've got one dragon. This guy here just took a tumble. That's an old dragon figure. That guy's dragon. These three are Zvezda. They're lousy kids. Horrible faces. I didn't replace any faces. I didn't have any Soviet faces back then. Um, just, my figure painting wasn't quite as fastidious, fastidious, fastidious as it is now. I spend a lot more time on my figures. Got a couple of dioramas on the go here. I'll probably get them posted up next month. I've been spending a hell of a lot more time on the figures, as you can see by the American figures there. A little bit, but, uh, and I've also been replacing resin heads. I've been doing a lot of resin heads lately, so, yeah. Um, that's the story. IS-3, two shots, two American tanks, with a bunch of guys scattered, and now they're regrouping. So there you have it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope this inspires some of you to get out there and build. You know, like I always used to say, you know, build, have fun, hang out with your family, don't be a, don't be a model nerd. And I should not say that. Be a model nerd. Be a good parent, be a good husband, wife, father, whatever. But you gotta have some time to yourself, guys. You gotta have that time to go sit in your room, sit wherever you sit, and build your kits without somebody busting your ass all the time. This is total therapy for me. For the, I never ever want to have. I never. I, I honestly don't ever care to monetize this again. This is strictly a hobby. This is my therapy, and it's expensive therapy but damn it's fun so guys thanks for watching if you hate it say this sucks dude man you suck that's a horrible kit you like it hey say great yeah good job man it's cool you know just say something positive negative thumb up thumb down i don't care just let me know you're watching all right later guys